Hey Gizmos, welcome back to the channel Gizmia for another reaction time video. Today we're still watching One Punch Man and it's now it's episode 3. So before we begin, one thing that I've forgotten to tell you for the past two videos is that we couldn't find the actual anime in English. So we're watching it in Japanese and then the subtitles are going to be in English. So, so don't worry, I mean I'm still going to try to comment as best as I can as to what's happening. If you get a little bit lost, I'm sorry for that. But we couldn't do it any other way. I still hope you enjoy it and that doesn't discourage you from keep on watching us. We'll try, we are trying our best here, <laughs> so I'm sorry. Well, um, and last episode season, I mean of episode two, well, it was pretty interesting. We saw a different side of the lady who's the younger sister of um, the tornado brat. <laughs> Which I like the name that Jenna's put, so that's what I'm going to call her from now on because it's easier. <laughs> and, well, Sonic fought against Saitama and, well, obviously he didn't win. But now he's going to stay with that mentality, which sucks for him because he thinks that he's never going to beat him. And that's why he had made him his rival because he really, really wanted to beat him and to prove it to himself, I guess, in a way, too. So that sucks for him. But I mean, well, we have to move on. <laughs> we can't always get everything. And it's just one person. And no one can really beat him. No one can beat Saitama. So if that's any consolation for poor Sonic. <laughs> but it did make me feel sorry for him. <laughs> well, uh, I want to see what episode 3 is about. It seems pretty good. I mean, all of them have been pretty good so far. So I hope this one doesn't fall far from the tree either. <laughs> well, let's begin. What is it now? Come on, get up. Tell me, Chiranko. Have you learned nothing in the past six months? When first I made you my disciple, I said to train like your life depended on it. Oh, I yes, because the other guy, the his you other dojo student, missed out you on it. Well, he came back to town and is trying to kill yeah, every villain. And Well, he actually did. He killed every villain and he tried to kill the heroes, too. <laughs> He beat me mercilessly. He'd been so kind-hearted before. There's something going yes, on. Yes, he did really beat him up. Didn't and I was he? hoping you guys would know what that something might be. I do not know. So I guess the bad guy, um, Ga Gato, I think is his name. I think he's going to be a bigger character because he said that he would come back in six months, and so now he's going However, to I can make an um, be a bigger the antagonist than when he was. He's probably going to be one of the biggest threats. The oh, yes, Gar. <laughs> and why is everyone there and with him? <laughs> now they're so all hanging out with Saitama. <laughs> it's the new place to be. <laughs> he has been added to the association's wanted list as a violent monster. Bang himself has volunteered to take him down. A monster? Yeah, because that was his disciple. Been at HQ. The association has been keeping it under wraps. But should a violent battle ensue, it could quickly spin out of control. Perhaps that is the reason why Bang pushed you away. I had no idea. So Master Bang considers me a burden? But that is simply my hypothesis. Your thoughts, Master? I don't know, man. I mean, it's not like I know the old dude all that well or anything. Silver Fang. Silver Fang, that's the name of the dojo man. How'd I get stuck with Cape? <laughs> Bald Cape. That's the name they. That's what they picked out for him. Who are you? Chiranko, a pissant who is Bang's current top disciple master. You two have met. Huh? Uh, yes, he's the. Uh, now he's the number one disciple of Bang. I can allow myself to be a burden for the sake of my master. I need to stop Garo. But it's not like he's gonna pop up right next to me. Ugh. And even if I did manage to find him, I'd only... Hey, numbnuts. Oh, be careful what you wish for. Right? Yes, oh, it's indeed. a Moomin Rider. <laughs> yes, I like him, but... Hunt? Oh. What on earth are you talking about? This entire discussion Man, I like him. I don't want him to get to hurt. He always ends up getting hurt at the end. Monster. It's the short end of the stick. I pray like you. <sighs> there you are. You sure this is the guy? Oh, I'm sure. Now, time for a little payback. Oh, he also beat all of them up. Tank Top Vegetarian. <laughs> I love their names because there's Tank Top Tiger, now there's Tank Top Vegetarian, they're like cousins or brothers. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> yes, there's a whole bunch of them. Leaving alive either. Now die. News didn't matter that they came with a bunch of them. He's still gonna beat their butts in. What? 
I hear you roughed up my. Oh, tank top master. He's the big one. This is perfect. I'm friggin' stoked. <laughs> Why would he waste a punch by punching the floor just to show how strong he is? I mean, we know how strong you are, but you're just tying yourself out for no reason. Oh, he just... I guess he is really strong, yeah. No, yeah, last time he picked up a whole big old rock. He's very limber, though. Gato's very limber. How is he still standing? Hey, <laughs> brothers. You got lucky, free. <laughs> Who in the hell is this guy? Is he even human? He used to be human. Who knows what he did when he left? Now he's bad. Alone in the world. The same as you. Don't be ridiculous. Mm -hmm. I'll have you know okay, I've been another master. To several hundred disciples. You cut ties with everything you had to come to your younger brother's aid. And for that, you have my thanks. Oh, that's his older brother. Garo fellow, he'll come after my dojo soon enough. <laughs> of course I came. We must be careful with this one brother. You cannot I didn't imagine think you could get much bigger than Fang. I mean, much older, but yes, apparently you can. <laughs> and his hair's longer, he's going bald. Assistance. It's funny when they do that, because they're already bald, but they have crazy long hair and when it is growing. <laughs> One thing's for certain. Oh, yes, he's bleeding. He's getting beat up, too. But he's not stopping. Why are my telling me to kill him here and now? Yes, he'll pose a bigger threat. Jesus. It's like he's spitting out or coughing out his whole intestine. <gasps> Why would he get in front? Are a class S hero on the verge of killing a human? You already won the fight. We're supposed to protect oh, people. God. This bastard attacked a hero. It's yes, he started it. <laughs> like, that's a very uh, mature <laughs> answer. What he says is true. I didn't earn the right to wear the tank top of a hero. <laughs> He'd start wearing a tank top. <laughs> that was his initiation, the tank top. To never harm others again. Yeah, alright. Well, what is his I'm word for, good for? Sorry for the trouble. I mean, how's he gonna know? Like hell. See, because he's a villain, he was just gonna go back on his word. Too bad, but expect it. You die right here, right now! Oh! Damn. Bash like his face in. I try to avoid using the old geezer style. Oh. Oh, yes, because their dojo is named that the Fist of Flowing Water. So that's why. Yes, it makes sense that he would teach him all his tricks because that was no his way. student. He was hiding his true strength. Imagine that. A class S hero down on his knees. Don't think you've won. You caught me off guard, is all. <laughs> I really want to I'm gonna beat him <laughs> You got a front row seat to see Garo the monster murder all your bros. Garo? Oh no! He's that human who calls himself a monster! Mm -hmm. No, please, don't do it! Leave him alone! Justice! Roman <laughs> right away with this justice grass, it doesn't do anything. And, oh! He's bashing his head in. Oh, that's noise. That noise is not nice. It's not pleasant. That fighting style of yours is pretty predictable. You're all done, tank top master. Right. All that's left is a little clean. No, run away, guys. Run away. Let's see how you do against oh. the whole legion of tank tops. Oh, of course not. <laughs> but yes, I mean it's not about how many you are, it's about your skills, and it's just not enough right now. What's that enough with him? Against him. Oh, yes, and he's listening to everything. That's enough, Garo! You're a disgrace to the dojo! Take this, Mr. Flowing Water Crunch! He should actually be the only one who can beat him because he knows the same techniques as the other one because they're both it seems we have arrived oh, too late. pupils. Truly I was going to say they're both students. But so tell me. 
Oh, I think. Do you have any idea what Garo's think they lost? Like What's wrong? Yep. Jarong. Pretty bad. Yeah. Oh, it looks. Oh, his welts are horrible. Looks like he got stung by various bees. He's a class S hero. I heard Tantop's <laughs> disciples and Woman Rider were all beat to hell too. So he's what is he like a and pig or something? An eater, but do? it's Come his on, beak isn't that big. Phone, will ya? How about the three of us capture this hero hunter ourselves? Yeah, right. Yes, how are you gonna do that? Yes. Yeah, and well, the but one of the best ones, rank right seven. Some scary monster. He's just a tough human being. Yes, but he's a human who's acting like an actual villain. But they know a little more. Oh, he thinks he's a monster. If an opponent comes at you like this, step back. Attack from the front. First, you dodge, then punch. And if he managed to drop in on you from above, kapa. Hi, sir. <laughs> I can't believe you came all this way to see me. Thanks, man. Mm. I appreciate it. Sure. Picked up some bananas on the way. Ah, oh, that sounds mm. great. Here are bananas. Mm. Oh, they're for you then. Yes. I read about everything that happened in the Hero <laughs> Association newsletter. Mm. It said that dozens of heroes were beaten by a single butt kicking monster. What do you survive, huh? Here, have a banana. <laughs> it was a human that did it. What? He called himself a monster. And he was tough as hell. Scared. Yes, he's crazy strong. And he's also kind of lean. He's kind of small. I mean, compared to the bigger monsters or villains, he's pretty small compared to them. His moves. Huh. They're sophisticated martial arts techniques. It seems Silverfang raised a true monster when he trained that freaking guy. Top uh, master. Who's got to butt it into our conversation? <laughs> what? That's Tank Top Master, the class S here. <laughs> I didn't know who it was. <laughs> Beating of all. At least say that I put up the best fight! <laughs> Damn! I never imagined I'd lose to a punk like him. Those martial arts he used were brutal as hell. Martial arts? How about a banana? <laughs> uh, okay. He's just handing his bananas like a minion, almost. Hey there, kid. Huh? That's an interesting looking book you got there. Hmm, now he's got his hand on the manual or on the little booklet. He's a class S hero. He's the strongest ever. And this is Lightning Genji, a class A hero. Got his autograph, <laughs> see? <laughs> yeah, so you did. I want his autograph too. You think maybe you could help me find him? For sure. So you're into heroes too, mister? That hero almanac is pretty cool. Say, you think I could borrow it for a week or so? No way! Get your own if you want one. Don't be all stingy. <laughs> Classic kid, never wanting to let his toys be... Um, n never wanting to let his friends borrow his toys. Miss all the monsters too. Now that's exciting. What? You like the monster pages? But they're so scary. Well, he is a monster, but of course, no one These knows that yet. Way cooler. You're kidding. That's some weird taste, mister. <laughs> oh, man. I wish I were listed in this book. You want to be a hero? Me too, same here. But I suck at sports and stuff. That's probably for the best. <laughs> that really wasn't very nice. <laughs> but Moment Rider is setting different boundaries for heroes because he doesn't have any special ability per se, either. I say shows up at his usual pub around this time. Get you later, turd. <laughs> Be careful on the it even toys. has their details of what they are. I will. By the way, don't call me Mr. Got it. I'm not some old grandpa. Oh, huh? dude. <laughs> Sorry, you say something, mister? <laughs> take that, huh? Go home, runt. That's kind of dangerous because they even have details on how their life is and what they're doing and their favorite things and... I don't His know, I don't think that's very smart considering they're people that are that would be looking joints, for them and not for the right reasons. Who suffer a loss of physical function. Most monsters rely on their immense strength and size, which they unleash with extreme violence. But Garo is different. His techniques are devised for breaking humans. In other words, mm -hmm. he's built for the sole purpose of defeating heroes. It's Taranko, Dad! <laughs> Have a baby. Yeah. No hard feelings, okay? Why would he put it on his leg? <laughs> if you want help learning martial arts, you should ask Master Bang. He seems to have taken a liking to you, so... Well, 
I mean, the old dude might. He's not just any old guy it's either. And rude. You can't just waltz into a tournament and challenge professionals. First, you master the basic forms. No, maybe best to build stamina. Running up and down a couple hundred stairs would help. Actually, the dojo could use a good cleaning. Look, if you don't know anyone, <laughs> just forget it. They applied a total Daniel sign with him, like Karate Kid of wax on, wax off. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I still have the admission ticket. Here. It's all crumpled up. I registered to fight, but I'm going to have to forfeit my spot. This will get you inside, though. So take it and go watch the matches. You'll get to observe mm. lots of fighting styles. Cool, man. Thanks. Yeah, that would be good. A stare. <laughs> yeah, I'm injured. It says the top prize is three million. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's a big tournament. Three million is a nice chunk of change. <laughs> Just to be clear, you can't enter in someone else's place. Hey, are you listening? <laughs> He's already got his ideas to get money. <laughs> Word with you. Outside. I'm kind of drinking here. Kick rocks. What in the hell? Oh, man, you wasted it. <laughs> Jesus, he just cut his drink in half. All right, then, tough guy. There's a parking lot nearby. We'll do it there. I've seen your kind before. Dweebs looking to take on a professional hero. <clears throat> if it's liquid courage giving you brass balls, better step off now. While well, you can still walk, that is. Quiet down. I'm not drunk. But you're... <laughs> <laughs> oh, he nicked him. Not too sharp, are you? Some hero hunter. How did tank top master lose to a jerk off like you? See, I ain't too bad at Golden hunting myself. <laughs> so I'll lay you out quick and get me another beer. They all think he's, the that they're gonna be him. Movement. In that case, try this on for size. Rebound shot. Ah. Whoopsie. That was pretty smart, though. He ricocheted all off of everywhere. And heroes incredible. You think that was just luck? I'd say it's about your coordination being off because you're hammered. Well, it seems pretty spot on still, even though if he's drunk. Man. Don't worry, I got plenty of balls left for you. <laughs> Shape memory, golden bullets. Mode, multi-shot. Killer move. Golden breakout! Whoa. <laughs> He's dodging all that with minimal movement. This guy's on another level. Still, mm -hmm. I got one. Didn't he say he had plenty of ammunition? Now he's already outdone it all. Oh, he just knocked the bullet out of the way. So what do you think? Ain't monsters incredible? It's he is pretty now. amazing, but he's die. a villain, so I don't like him. <laughs> it's like, die, die, die. Oh, he's the butler dude. Yeah, I haven't seen him since the other episode. I thought he had died. I didn't see you in the pub for our rendezvous, so I thought perhaps you'd spring forgotten about mustachio. our Spring Mustachio. Class A hero, <laughs> Spring Mustachio. <laughs> How kind of you to know. And I presume you are the much-rumored hero hunter. We have a winner. And your prize is that you're gonna get crushed too. I managed to injure his right leg. Mm-hmm, and there's a little scratch on his face. I see it. Thank you for the helpful information. <laughs> These are pretty tight quarters for that pointy stick you're waving around. Let's find out, shall we? Oh, and his blade also curves. I forgot about that. That was pretty cool. But why do they always waste all their moves just on the entry part? They're just getting tired. Tomboy. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was pretty amazing. Oh. Not. Didn't you know? Your fancy moves are listed in the Hero Almanac. Once I've got that info, it's over. Listen up, you cocky dirtbag. You've got the upper hand, but even we managed yeah, to Yeah, someone's you. bound to get him, but... Oh, I'll be getting much stronger. Uh, how many is he gonna wipe out before that? And it's really not also just the fact that he's wiping him out. It's their ego, I mean, it's their... You know, their confidence is shattered. <laughs> it's more psychological than physical. Relax, huh? Do you need to relax every day? Yes, I do. Maybe next time I'll bring a my mask along. What? Are you serious? I'm like his biggest fan. I'll introduce you for a kiss on the cheek. I don't know. That seems kind of fishy. You really, really mean it. <laughs> introduce him to me, too. I'd be happy to put a kiss on your cheek. 
Yes, because he was just a punk. Now I feel like I stepped in shit. <laughs> Fighting evil on the front line? What a Ooh, load yes. of crap. Oh, good. Finally. Hmm? I've looked all day. Was he tailing me? Is he a hero too? Never seen that face before. He finally get him? Trying to climb the ranks by catching a big fish like me. A table's turn. Huh? What's the big idea? You're trying to rob me? <laughs> Who do you think you are? Don't bother me when I'm shopping. Oh, there's no Excuse way. Me. Yes, then like he's going to. <gasps> he was going for another thing. Oh, that was really cool. I thought he might be kind of an opponent. Gato might be an opponent for Saitama, but apparently not because he just used his best move. I mean, Gato used his best move on him. Well, probably not his best move, but you know. And he didn't do any damage at all. And the other one just also whacked him, hit him, and made him go unconscious. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Okay, so now then, I guess the next episode is going to be about the tournament, which is going to be really good, because I don't know if he's going, I think he is going to enter, yes, as Chanako, is his name? I think he's going to enter as him because he was already getting ideas and he was staring very intensely at that ticket because he needs money. <laughs> he's always needing money. That's why he's always looking for the best um, discounts and everything at the market. <laughs> but his bananas look really good. They did. They made me hungry, honestly. <laughs> I don't know about you guys. But so don't forget to leave in the comments what you thought about this episode. Tell me what you think is going to be in store for the next episode. Are you also excited for the tournament? Because I am. It looks like it's going to be pretty good. And if Gato enters too, which he might, unless he beats him first. Unless they, unless Saitama beats Gato first. But I hope they enter and I hope they fight each other. Oh, that's going to be really exciting. I can't wait for it. Well, don't forget to like and subscribe if you liked it. <laughs> and I'll see you next time, guys. <laughs> Sorry, I was about to say Gato again. But thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye, Gizmos.